around the phalange, all the way around the sides. Look, oh, it already looks so much healthier. Look at that, you guys. The famous Chamorro avocados. Do you think Beatrice is gonna want avocados on her nails? I don't know. She got cherries last time she was here. Really? She got some cherries and then she bought like white and black butterflies. Did you tell her she has to sing if she does a live video? No, I just said you said that you want Chamorro cuisine. You didn't tell her she has to sing? No. I don't know if she's singing. No, she, she we'll does karaoke. To, we'll have to go over and then she can come in and be like, half a day, everybody, from the micro alienation of Guam. That'd be interesting. It was really funny because I thought of Bobby this weekend because he said that um, he likes Debbie from the Adam's Family movie. And it came up in my Hulu feed, the Adam's who? Family. Bobby? No, who? Debbie from the Adam's Family, oh, the second one. Oh, Debbie. Yeah. Fester's wife. Yes. He said that's him, that's the spirit animal, Debbie. <laughs> All because they didn't buy the right Cinderella or no Barbie doll, Barbie doll. Mm -hmm. I actually didn't have press-ons. I um, did a plumping manicure, so we're doing another plumping manicure mm -hmm. press-on job. Let's bake this 30 seconds inside the dazzling darling. Huh? This is called press-on gel. Yes, it is a multi-use builder gel in a bottle. So it's designed specifically for one, two, three, go application, but we also use it as a natural nail strengthener to give volume to the nail, as an extension gel. You can use it as a builder in a bottle. There are so many uses for it. Hello, Catherine. So we're gonna do our second coat now. And the second coat's gonna be a little bit thicker to build up the shape of the phalange. Well, you can use base gel for a lot of things, but it's usually used as a base for gel polish application. Some people use it as kind of like a base coat also if they want a really, really smooth surface when they're um, doing design work and things like that. So there's lots of ways you can use it as well. Hi, Antonia. Hello, Mariah. How was your guys' uh, Memorial Day? What did you guys do? Never a dull moment here at CanopyTour.com, even on Memorial Day. I had a long distance, what was it, Zoom meeting. Oh yeah, we were on a Zoom call today. Yeah. In the UK. It was really nice. Very nice. Spanish guy who was in the UK. There's a lot of people from Spain living in, um, in England. And in France too. Because really? their economies are stronger. Spain has been going through the big gigs in the last few years, so a lot of them go to uh, France and England to work. That makes sense. Bobby says, I want to watch Adam's family now. Oh, With Debbie. After a month of having one, two, three, go nails on, I did a fill with one, two, three, go gel. I think she means DIY press gel. Uh-huh. Love my nails. Great. I'm so happy to hear that. With a press on gel. And it level, self levels out as well as you guys can see, so there's very, very minimal filing that we have to do. It's been a minute since you've done my nails. Like four weeks? Five weeks? Yeah. They left pretty well, I didn't break anything. Mm -mm. And we took them down a lot too right now. Mm -hmm. They brought a lot. Yeah, I had uh, someone come visit me and as she was chatting, I was like, oh, I better hurry up or else we're going to finish at 10 o'clock at night. <laughs> for Marisol. Look at that, you guys. So beautiful. So let us bake this for one minute inside the Dazzling Darling Lamp. I'm going to get my little box brush wiper. 
you like avocado toast, Ignacia? Yeah. That sounds good, doesn't it? I love avocado. Should we write avocados on your nails? No. Why not? I don't think you're not to put it on the avocado bed, That's the idea. How about avocado and a teddy bear? Avocado, a vegetable or a fruit? It's a fruit. It's a fruit. Mm -hmm. What is this thing on the avocado again? It's a little. Oh, you have to use this one on me. This avocado. How cute. It's a little squiggly. Oh, yeah. yeah. Nice. So we're going to remove the oxygen inhibition. Oh, oxygen. Inhibition layer. AKA the sticky layer. So that way we can shape the nail. Because if you go in and you start shaping with the stickiness on the nail, it will get all over your files and all over your tools and it will not be cute. I was thinking of ordering the heart pink lamp, but do you use it the same way as the lamp you're using? Yes. Yes, you do. Hi, what is the discount code? You can use Dove 3 and get you some avocados on me, guys. The 20% off sale for uh, all the precious mineral colors is PM20 and it ends today at midnight. Mm -hmm. So we're going to give her a little squabble yeah. for the career realness. And after Master's PM sale is on, the PM20, you guys can still use my dub 3 if you want. You want to be in the lead? Help your fellow tomorrow avocado lover out. Your promo code should have been half a day. Half a day. <laughs> That's funny. People would be like, how do you spell half a day? Exactly, what do you mean so hard? Um, I've seen that one he's using is a higher bulk. Yeah, so the dazzling garden lamp is. Yes. The cookie lamp is also limited edition, so whatever is left now, it will not be restocked as it is a one-time limited edition uh, collectible item. Sean King, yes, PM20 will give you 20% off on all precious mineral polishes, and it ends today. At midnight, yes. Actually, it ends at 11.59 p.m. Arizona time. Hello, I bought base shot and do not know how to use it. Catherine, we did... Um... I explained it at the beginning of the video, yeah. And it also says on the website, too, on the product description, how to use it as well, too. So basically, just the base gel, you can use it before you put on any gel polish. Some people use it to apply one, two, three, and go nails. Um, for further description, you can check out that description box. Just visit enocouture.com, the bomb.com. Beautiful. And look how strong her nail is too. Like super strong, like these are not going anywhere. I need to put the new plumping manicure. The plumping manicure. My nails break really easily. I love it. My nails look strong. So let's go in with the golden wands. Just the polishes. Is there a code I could use for my order? So yeah, so you would use PM20 and that's only going to take 20% off for precious minerals. Other than that, there really isn't any other active uh, promo codes, but if you want, you can use my promo code, Dove, three. Half a day, 10. <laughs> That'll take 10% off your order. Let's use a pink magic wand bit to blend in that cuticle ever so gently. Am I in frame on your side? Yes. I did like the game changer. Like literally, it has revolutionized the industry. It just made everything so much easier. And faster as well too. So a quick little pass on the top surface of the phalange just to make sure she's nice and even Steven. Even Stevens with Chrissy Carlson Romano. Really? That's really old stuff too. They're 
good show. It's like nice nostalgic, like comedy hour. <laughs> That's a lot of work to do. Like, they have to purposely go through all of even seasons. How many episodes did the show have? Honestly, I don't He also likes to watch like the old Disney original Channel movies. Mm-hmm. Like, Smart House. Motor Cross, Smart House, Double Team. Octuplets. Yeah, Smart House is actually really good. Smart House is really good. Yeah. Um, Smart House is really good. Yeah. 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 Which is the one that the girl from Lizzie McGuire did that she shot in New Zealand? I can't remember what the name of it was though. Did I tell you? No. It was, um, what was Lizzie McGuire's friend's name? Miranda. Miranda. She was oh, Miranda. get a clue or get, a, get some, or that darn cat or that alley cat. That darn alley cat. It okay. was like a mystery, kind of like a mystery, right? Yes. She was with that tall boy with the sweet hair. Mm hmm. Yeah, I know. Cowbells or. Was that? Did Raven Simone ever do any Disney Channel original movies? She didn't do Disney Channel original movies, I don't think, but I know she did like College Road Trip, which was a Disney movie with Martin Lawrence. Was it good? Yeah. Or Martin. was it kind of okay? It was good. She was going to college and that was like embarrassing. Martin Lawrence? She also did Dr. Doolittle. Yeah, she's done a lot of stuff. She hasn't done anything recently, though. I'm going to go back in with the diamond prep bit and blend out that cuticle to make sure it's really, really seamless. So, how many of the ladies here have watched the new Cruella movie? Let's talk about it. I watched it last night, and I actually liked it. Max hasn't seen it. I probably won't either. I'm not that big of a fan of Cruella de Vil. You would think you would like her. She's Why? Like a fashion user. She's not afraid to tell people how it is. And she's like, you know, a go-getter. I'm not a fashion But you're a go-getter. I am. And wear fur. Does she wear fur in this one? No, this is the like where she's just like super into like the design. Of the stuff. Uh, is she uh, like a fashion designer or what is Corilla Yes, she is. Oh. That is wild. Watch that one. I've never seen The Conjurer. It's on Netflix. And it's on HBO. Really? Yeah. Both of them. And then I think the Annabelle one down there too. We watched the creation of Annabelle. Is that the one where it's like on a farm or something like that, right? Yeah, it's like the prequel. It explains like how Annabelle possessed the little girl. But you never see like the Annabelle movie, like the, the demon. Yeah, it's you like do. all like tension is what it is. No, you see the demon. What does it look like? It's ugly and it's black and it's tall and it has like these long fingers. Really? Yeah. What about A Quiet Place 2? I was thinking about seeing that but like I remember the first one was so good because the tension that yes. they built but then you see the monster that, or the alien whatever it, it is. ruined it right? Yeah it's yeah. like a giant cricket. That's what I remember it looked like. And I was like oh it, they never should have shown it. I think it would have been a better movie. Yeah. And this is the Danadine. In the first yeah, one? Yeah, he died and she's like there with a newborn. Like, how are you supposed to keep a newborn quiet? So what's this new one about? I don't know. I just remember they were running. Because all those, like, monster things were in their house. Crickets, giant crickets. <laughs> I might watch these because I need to know what happened. Let's move the... Buffer, make sure all the edges are nice and even. Marie says you have two full sets every time, like the one, two, three, curl. Uh, it depends on the length of the nail. If the nails are more on the shorter side, you can definitely fill them, and we've uh, shown that technique many times. If they're longer, I would remove them and do a fresh set every at least 21 days. Keep them looking nice. And it, yeah, it really does look better when you do a new set. You can fill them, but I don't recommend it. 
But on shorter nails, you can do a fill and get away with it. On longer ones, you would have to like rebalance the nail after a whole, uh, maybe four, four or six weeks and build up the structure again. So it's just easier to uh, do a fresh set. And these look off pretty easy too, so. Where's everybody today? I think they'd be all up in here with the glamour for the snatching of the phalanges. Let's push back that cuticle one more time so that we can polish it. So we're going to do some cat eyes, some avocado. You sure do you want the gold flash? So we're going to do 80, which is like this really pretty like sparkly beige cat eye color. And this is from Precious Minerals. Let's go ahead and do one. Oh. And I'm going to do two coats of this color. So the first coat of the color will not have the cat eye effect. Because you want to layer this color on. I was like, why are her eyebrows so defined? That bothered me. It made it unrealistic. Not when they're like running away from aliens. <laughs> they should have made them look a little bit more beat up. Like, well, how would she get her eyebrows so snatched? So this is the gold flash gel. This is 148. California Adventure. Did you get a park offer? I did. I see lots of pictures. But from what I see, the Spider-Man ride doesn't seem that exciting. So it's like a whole, like, it's like a little town of marble? It's tiny though. It's only like four acres. So it's smaller than, like, Disneytown? Probably. It only has one ride. gift shop, no, two gift shops, and a restaurant, and the Guardians of the Galaxy ride. So where the Guardians of the Galaxy ride used to be, it used to be like a Bugs Life or something like that, right? Oh, I remember that. Yeah, they got rid of that, and they made it the Avengers Camp. And there's like a, a sanctorium for Doctor Strange, or Doctor Who, one of those people. Oh, Doctor Strange. Mm-hmm. I sent you a picture of the uh, spaceship and you never said anything. I did. The Millennium Falcon or what is it called? Oh wow, that's awesome. But I love Avengers. Marvel. 
Really? Yeah. Let me do this one again. Debbie says the guy, um, the dad who was in the first one, he directed the second one. Isn't the guy who plays the dad, he's like the wife or the husband of that girl in real life? Yeah, I think so. There we go. Shell 148, which is the gold one. It's pretty, isn't it? and Marvel is that Disney has the rights uh, west of the Mississippi and Universal has it east of the Mississippi so Universal Orlando has Marvel stuff they have, like a, weird, they have a Hulk right. ride they have like a storm thing they have a Spider-Man ride and they had a Spider-Man that you could meet and Lena was like his voice is weird he sounded really whiny so let's apply some avocados on these phalanges. What are you going to do with the blank one? I'm going to put the avocados on it. I'm going to leave the base natural. So that way the focus is the avocado. Bobby says, Kitty Galaxy is so satisfying. And remember, use your silicone tool and press down firmly. The famous avocado phalange. Application of avocado. See, look how cute it looks. Oh, I like it. It says avocado. Trust the process, Ignacio. You have to put like two little dots there so it has like a little eyes. Why should the avocado have eyes? Because it should be cute. Cartoonized. Like my socks. <laughs> you have avocado socks? I do. Really? It's, it says um, something, something about. I don't know. I'll wear them tomorrow. I'll show you. They're like your guac and amazing or something. Or really? Something like that. Your guac and amazing? Yeah. Oh my or, god. Or, I don't know. Something like that. And they have like these really cute, like they're it's like a chili dog, right? Mm -hmm. But it's like a dog and, a hot, and like wearing hot dog buns with a chili like hat. So cute. Whoops. Were they like a novelty gift or were they like something, or you bought them? I got them at Old Navy. Oh, and really? I bought them just because of like, I saw they had like really cute avocados on them. You're like, I love avocados. Mm -hmm. And then in the pack of my socks, they had other cute little novelty characters on them. Really? Yeah. Is the gel magnetic as well as reflective? This one is reflective, this one is magnetic. So you want eyes on this one then? Yeah. Yeah, I guess. Like two little dots or what? Yeah, and like a little smile. Okay, let's put two little dots then. We're gonna use our black gel polish and we're going to use our dotting tool. And our black gel polish is zero, zero, two. Like that? Yes. Oh my gosh, I love it. And then he gets a little smiley. And let's put some on this avocado as well. Oh, look how cute my little avocado is. My little avocado family. He's so cute. Your mom's calling. Oh, she is. Mm -hmm. oh. You can answer on that one till I'm on live. Like about half an hour, maybe. He says about 30 minutes. Oh. 
There are your smiley faced avocados. What do you think? Oh, they're so cute! I love it. Let's bake it. 30 seconds. Simple. You guys see the little baby avocados, you guys? Look at how cute they are. I use my purple vegan liner brush today from the vegan four pack. Do you want some glitter on the avocado nails? Some yeah. gold glitter, maybe? So we'll use 24K. He looks so cute. He looks so happy and then he's holding a little sign that says avocado. Because he's letting the world know that he is an avocado. So I'm going to do one coat of clear press on gel on the entire nail. And this is going to plump it up. Give the designs dimension and volume. What is the magnetic color? It's precious minerals 80. Yes, it's like a nude cat eye color. Very pretty. Max, are you wearing boots today? No. Antonio says, I need to see your boots, Max. They look cool. I'm wearing uh, Dolce Gabbana sneakers. Or trainers, as some people call them as well, too. Bobby is so cute. I got black on this one. Very brown today, very earth toned. Mm -hmm. With the happy little avocado. Mm -hmm. Sparkle. What are you gonna call your little avocados? I don't know, you guys, what should I name my avocados? I have two I have to name. I call one guac, the other one mole. <laughs> mole? <laughs> guac and mole. <laughs> or chips and dip. Bio. Pico. Pico Rivera. Some people they look like boots. Don't even want to see. They look cute. Here they are. So let's go in with some 24K glitter. We're going to use our silicone tool. You talked some... to her already, Debbie. No worries. To who? To your mom. Oh. So don't forget to call your mom. What did she say? Guacamole, Antonio said. So, did they ever say anything about the movie? Like, if it was better than the first one? Yeah, no one said. Did she like it? She didn't watch it. Oh, she didn't? Mm -mm. How did she know it was about the daughter then? Because she said she watched some interview the guy did, because uh... he's directing the second one. Did he direct the first one as well? I think so. Which glitter is this? 24K? Yes. I wonder what Netflix show, or what is it that she watches? Amazon? Show she's watching right now. I'm not sure. So exciting. I'm like really into borders right now. Really? Yeah. Is it good? Have you ever seen it? Not recently, no. They have some on um, Hulu and HBO, mm -hmm. or not HBO, Hulu and Netflix. Netflix has the newer seasons, and I'm just like astonished at people and how they live. Really? Yeah. I do like extreme cheapskates every once in a while. Yeah. Good ideas from that show. <laughs> Why is that funny? Because. I don't 
don't know, like this one lady named Becky. She owned a hotel or like a motel. Mm -hmm. and every single room in her motel was full of stuff. Ooh. And not just stuff, but like bugs and mice. Really? And she would go to gas stations to use the bathroom because she didn't have a working bathroom at all. Would people go to her hotel? No. Ooh. So that episode was crazy and the, the one I'm watching now, I haven't finished it. It's about this guy named Dennis and his wife has Parkinson and she's like really ill. Mm -hmm. She's her caretaker. And like they live in complete filth. Like you can't even walk. Oh my god. It's so bad. Whoops. Made me nervous. About hoarding? <laughs> no, like they live in complete filth. That Jeez. Was so bad. There's a really famous episode on YouTube where they find out, they find out that um, their brother's a cross-dresser and they find like all kinds of like very explicit items. Really? Yeah. Is that on Hoarders? I think so. Or Buried Alive, one of those shows. Oh my gosh. I'm so distraught over the one I watched recently where she literally was like wearing his adult diapers and taking them off and throwing them on the floor. And like using cups to use the bathroom in and throwing it on the floor. Oh my god. Like, she did not care. She Look how cool that looks. She was mentally ill. I like my strange addiction too every once in a while. Yes. Have you seen the one where the guy was like in love with his car? Yeah, the red one. <laughs> and he would like make out with it. Yeah. But the car was a guy. Yeah. It's like, what's going on here? Or the blow up doll one. I remember the balloon one. She would eat soap or those um, dryer sheets. Oh, yeah, baby powder too. And her wig was full of baby powder. I saw one when this lady was eating her husband's ashes. Oh, yeah, I remember that. And concrete too. I was like, this cannot be real. Just like I do it because it's like you go with me. And I'm like, lady, somebody check you in. <laughs> oh, that's pretty. What do you guys think? Okay, let's bake that. The ones that get me are the ones hoarding animals. Yes, that one's so sad. Oh, I haven't seen that. There was one where they were like, well, they found a bunch of dead cats. Oh my gosh. Under a bunch of trash. Dead cats? Yeah. People do crazy things. They forget that they had animals, okay? <laughs> it sounds like little Edie. Like this one lady had so much stuff, it went up to her roof, and to get into her front door, she was climbing on trash. Oh my god. Just to get into her house. And she had cats and she forgot she had mittens. Yeah. Binks, little Binks was in there. Oh, don't say that about my baby. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Let's we're gonna do two coats of shiny gel too. I did my own nails yesterday with the one she could go. Had some bubbles, but they look great. Practice, awesome. Practice, practice. And I mean look how fun and easy it is, you guys too. It's a great way to like glam up everything. Look at my avocados, they're truly a little accent. So we're gonna do two coats of shiny to make sure everything is really well encapsulated and sealed and shellacked in. Yeah, that happens to me. Well, that's what the doctor said, what happens to me. The pica illness, because when I'm pregnant, I like to chew on ice. Oh, that's um. It's because I'm iron deficient. Mm -hmm. Like he's still with me. <gasps> Do you remember my strange addiction? The guy that liked old ladies? No. He would only drink grandmothers. Yeah, like they had to be like a certain age. Like really old. Like he dig like he was into that or he did it because like he wanted monetary gain? No, he was into it. Oh, wow. No, I didn't see that one. I ordered before pre-COVID. My order took a long time. I understand that it was COVID. Our order's taking long right now. I loved my last order. I had to order some more. No, orders aren't taking as long as last, like, the last, the first COVID wave right now. Um, right now, they're about five days for processing. At the most, usually. Yeah. They usually ship before that, though. And we have expedited shipping. We can get it into two, uh, two days or next day. And we have Afterpay. We have Klarna. Let's bake that for 30 seconds. My Strange Addiction. <gasps> and then it was what my favorite episode is I'm Addicted to Being Pamela Anderson. No. Yes. So she would do surgeries to look like her? She, well, she thought she did, but she did not. Oh, sorry. She looked like she ate Pamela Anderson. Oh my gosh. 
she was scam spammy. And she was like, my name is Caroline Anderson. And I'm obsessed with being Pamela Anderson. And she was like, if you go out with me, you won't come home till Tuesday. Is she Irish? No, she was a scouse oh, wow. from Liverpool. And like uh, her dad owned a hair salon and this guy that was doing her hair, she was like, oh my gosh, she's just so glamorous. <laughs> Poor Caroline, she was, she did not look like Pam. She, not. she thought she did. And she was like, I'm gonna go to uh, California so I can uh, manifest my Pamela, Pamification. We're gonna do our second coat of shiny. So she went to LA and she was like doing things that Pamela Anderson would do. Like go to her restaurants and she went on an audition and they're like, uh, you can't go on audition like as an actress pretending to be someone else. It doesn't work that way. No, and she's like, but I am Pamela Anderson. <gasps> oh, and there was another one too that I'm addicted to being Madonna. And it was a guy that was addicted to being Madonna. It was so, like, fake. It was kind of, she was just really tripped me out. So I want to know, like, I try to understand the mid space in it, like... To being addicted to being Madonna? I get it sometimes. <laughs> and it was funny, like, the guy was, like, at some therapy sessions, like, dancing. And then they were like, who do you see in the mayor? Do you see you or do you see Madonna? And he was like, I see Madonna. And then he took his wig off and he started crying. We're, like, fake crying. I was like, oh my gosh. The lengths that people go to to be on television. For their 15 minutes of fame. For their 15 minutes of fame. True life? Yes. Did you ever see the one about being too. a Kardashian? No. Yeah. It was so bad. True life? Yeah, I'm addicted to being Kim Kardashian. It was so bad. No, yeah, I just remember true life. Like, I have an eating disorder or... They would be into like really hard narcotics. Yeah. I'm addicted to being young. I, I actually have that episode downloaded on my phone. <laughs> I'm addicted to being young and good one. it was okay. I had never seen it and um, I was like, oh, I'll buy it. It's only like $1.99 or something. I have that along with Sharpay's Fabulous Adventure. Beautiful. Let's bake this for one minute. Room Raiders and what was that next? Room Raiders. Oh, Say what? Karaoke. I have a friend. Okay, so she isn't Guamanian, but she's married to a Guamanian. Mm -hmm. and I met her with all the other Flamanian like family friends she was on next like I saw it like she showed it to me really she was on the next bus I was like no way is that where she met her husband no <laughs> wasn't Zach Efron on one of those room raiders or something like that no my sweet 16 mm. Tila Tequila Tila Tequila Tequila School of Rock Daisy of Love. Whoops. Daisy of Love. I love School of Rock. Really? I was so mad though when he didn't pick um, What's Her Face. Who? Daisy? No, the other one. I don't remember that. Part. I can't remember her name. There's one girl and I was like, why didn't you pick her? She was it for you. And then he did it again. I really like I Love New York though because she was crazy. For the love of Ray J. Her mom. I was obsessed with her mom. Sister Patterson. This, and her I mob wife, so was my Oh yeah. Too. They're supposed to be bringing it back. Really? With the same ones? Yeah, but Drew is not gonna be a part of it. Why? Because she's grown, she said. Then who's gonna fight with what's her name? Karen, I don't know. Who's gonna go find someone else to fight with Karen? And then Big Ange is dead too, so it's not gonna be the same. No. And I don't know if what's her face Renee's gonna do it. Oh my gosh, Renee would cry for over over everything. Yeah. So annoying. Like, I was like, breakfast table and she's like crying and throwing <laughs> orange juice everywhere. Taking to the days. A little bit of cotton candy cuticle oil. Now we might cuticle. No, better now. Better than before. With these tiny little avocados. What do you guys think of the avocados? Are you living for them? They have names now. Guac and Moly. And there we go. That's a wrap, you guys. Come through camera focus. We got some little cat eye there, some glitter action, some guacamole, some flash gel, and some more guacamole. They're so cute and pretty. 
Oh, look at that flash on the lamp and the hard light. So dope, right? Well, my loves, that's going to wrap it up for today's quick little live demo. I hope you guys had a safe and enjoyable Memorial Day. I love you guys so, so much. Stay safe, stay out of trouble, and we will see you guys in the next live video. Bye, everybody.